Hello, thanks so much for joining me for my Friday thoughts that's now become a thing. So today I'm going to be talking to you about my morning routine. Um, I'm a mum of two young children. We're currently in lockdown while, I'm film, while I film this and I've still kept my morning routine going throughout and it's probably kept me sane if I'm honest with you. Now it sounds hard work but if you take it um, one step at a time and make these adjustments, I promise you, it will make the world of difference, especially if you're a mum, because we don't get a lot of space generally. And I find it sets me up for the day and it makes me feel better. So the, the program I follow is called Miracle Morning, but you don't have to do Miracle Morning and there's lots of different alternatives, but essentially you are carving out time for yourself every single day and miracle morning the idea is that you get up earlier so instead of thinking i don't have time i just don't have time you make time you get up an hour earlier than you normally would and again you're going to think i'm too tired already i don't want to this routine gives me energy it's like going into the petrol station refueling my tank every morning it doesn't suck energy from me it gives me energy and so don't knock it till you've tried it. And like with my meditation video, you have to stick at it for at least 30 days, I think, before you really start to create that habit that feels great and feels good and natural. So I wake up, I don't wake up this early now because it's locked down and everybody has to have some sort of reward. So I don't wake up this early now, but the idea is you get up an hour earlier than you need to. I meditate. I have a list of affirmations that I've created. Now I'll do a video on affirmations, so watch out for that if you don't know much about it. But affirmations are basically statements where you are rewiring your brain. So for me, there's certain elements and ways that I think about things that I would love to change. So by affirming to myself these positive statements, you are rewiring your brain and eventually your subconscious will automatically reach for these thoughts rather than the ones you've, you've led yourself to believe all these years. So I have a list of affirmations that I say every morning out loud and I felt like a right wally when I first started doing it, but now the kids, just, the kids and my husband just know what I'm doing um, and it feels good. I exercise every morning without fail. So I do body coach at the moment because time is of the essence and I just wanna get it done. I'm also doing the couch to 5K. Any exercise is great even if you're running on the spot for five minutes like it's about getting your heart rate up and you know getting things moving getting that energy flowing getting rid of any stuck energy that's in your body from overnight doing that in the morning so that you're you're getting rid of that stuff and you're feeling good you've meditated you've said yourself some positive statements you've exercised i read now that can be audible or reading but i read something that's positive not just fiction although i love fiction as well but i read something that's class for self-development I guess so um, the universe has your back by Gabrielle Bernstein uh, Brené Brown is a massive influence for me I love Daring Greatly and um, Oprah's books I love Oprah and so I love um, to find out about new books as well at the moment I'm reading um, Vex King and I'm really really enjoying that good vibes good life I think is the title that's really good and um, so I do a little bit of reading and then journaling. Um, now, visualization is something that he recommends doing as well, and I do do visualization as well, but I must admit that's sometimes the thing that drops off because um, I've spent so long doing the other things that I run out of time, if you like. But I am somebody who visualizes all the time, you know. <laughs> I have no issue with visualizing, but generally, if you can spend some time visualizing what it is you're looking to do, feel, be, and um, that's always a good thing, but we'll touch on that in another video. And um, following that, I have my protein shake in the morning. So I start the day right. And I honestly, I love the mornings. I feel amazing after I've done all of that. I'm present with the children and generally feeling ready for the day. Um, so yeah, give it a try. Let me know how you get on. And uh, if you wanna know what book this came from, it's from The Miracle Morning by Hal Elrod. And, uh, it was a game changer for me. I started it in January this year and I'm absolutely loving it six months down the line. If you want to know more about this, then just let us know and we'll cover it in future videos. Thank you. Bye.